Right now, we're facing a man-made disaster of global scale. We, the mobile industry, with over 5 billion customers worldwide, have the responsibility to protect and sustain our future. You are the last best hope of Earth. The time for vision has gone. We want a future. Is that too much to ask? The time to act is now. And here are just some of the ways we are acting today. If we can take bolder and braver steps in relation to climate, we can make a difference. Because the biggest risk to climate is believing it's somebody else's problem to fix. We recently announced our new objectives to be carbon neutral by 2020, to produce enough renewable energy by 2025 to match 100% of our total requirement, and to reduce our emissions footprint by 50% by 2030. I wanted to share our commitment at Vodafone to help a sustainable planet. We've set an ambitious goal to halve our environmental impact by 2025. At BT, we have long recognised the importance of setting ambitious carbon reduction targets. Working with our colleagues and customers, we've been able to reduce our carbon intensity and we are now partnering with suppliers to reduce their emissions and spur eco-innovation, helping us to become a net zero emissions business by 2045. We were the first company in Asia, X Japan, to have our carbon reduction targets approved by the Science-Based Targets Initiative in late 2017, and we have since extended our commitment to become net zero by 2050. Serving an island community, we really understand how important uh, the issues of climate change and sea level rise are. Uh, we're fully supported to be carbon neutral for the whole island by 2030. The climate ambition that Terranor has is built on two pillars. One is about targets, to be carbon neutral in the Nordics before 2030, and to reduce the carbon emission in our Asian operations with 50% also before 2030. Today, I am happy to announce that we are advancing our commitment to zero emissions from 2050 to 2030 in our main businesses. Telia Company already uses 100% renewable energy across all its operations. We're reducing emissions by progressively improving our operational efficiencies. In 2019, we reduced our greenhouse gas intensity by 10%, even though the number of our base stations increased by 25%. Depuis 2016, Proximus is une entreprise neutre en carbone, avec 100% de notre consommation d'énergie qui vient de sources renouvelables. Et cette année, et afin d'avoir un impact immédiatement concret, nous avons lancé une grande campagne nationale pour collecter 100 000 vieux téléphones mobiles. We are the first operator in the Nordic and the Baltics to become climate neutral in our own operations, running our networks on 100% renewable electricity. The Globe Tower headquarters and two of our office facilities have been carbon neutral since October 2019 through the purchase of renewable energy. During the worldwide COVID-19 crisis, our networks provided services to humanity on health, education, entertainment, teleworking, with less greenhouse gas emission. A decarbonized world will be a digital world. But the mobile industry's greatest positive impact on climate change is the ability to enable other sectors in the economy to reduce their own emissions. None of this is possible to achieve alone. We are not big enough, any of us. So we need to collaborate. We need partnership. We need to do it together.